All right, welcome to this week's Collaborate Quickfire. Today I'm just gonna give you a few tips on how not to F up your recruitment process. In this really hyper competitive and really talent short market, it's important that if you get people to offer stage that you do get them across the line. And unfortunately it's a recruitment process that I think is letting a lot of businesses down um, at the moment in the current market. So number one is don't make the process too long. That's the number one thing we see is that time kills deals. So try and turn the process around as quick as you can. If it is gonna drag out or drag on, make sure you've got really, really high levels of communication. Uh, second thing is think about uh, your salary. Whatever's pre-agreed and verbally agreed in the process, make sure that's what comes through in the contract. Whatever you do, do not lowball them when it comes to offer time, um, something that they're not expecting. Uh, number three is KiwiSaver, make sure that is um, over and above base salary. We still see some businesses including it in their, in their package or in their base salary. Uh, and I think that actually makes your business look quite tight. Uh, last thing is think about your contract and what you actually include in the contract and what's agreed. Because it's important that everything that you've discussed throughout that recruitment process is included in, this, in the contract and please make sure that you get it right first time. Um, there's nothing worse than uh, details coming through which are not correct. It shows you really haven't been listening. And I think that leads me on to my last point, which is don't forget your recruitment process is a direct indication of what to expect when they join your company. So make sure it's really slick, make it exciting, make it engaging, and uh, you'll have a much higher hit rate of getting them across the line. So good luck and go well. Cheers.